So I found the question, you know, did Elon Musk buy the title of founder of Tesla? And we have Richard Mason here, whose bio on Quora says, I am a serial entrepreneur. And it's, I should specify it's spelled S-E-R-I-A-L. Like he didn't yes. invent a serial. No. He's just a serial entrepreneur. Like he can't get enough of it. Somebody stop him. He can't stop entrepreneuring. <laughs> Yeah, I can't. can't. <laughs> I don't even know why I do it. Turns out I only smart. I only start small businesses though. I have a thing for small businesses. Mister Mister FDIC, I gave you all the clues. Yeah. Uh, if you look at his picture though, uh, it looks like he's a serial something else. Yeah, for sure. Uh, okay, so he answers. Tesla was founded by Martin Eberhard and Mark Tarpening. Elon Musk was an early investor in the company who later became active in the management. When the company struggled to contain costs, investors forced the founders out. <laughs> Musk, along with early employees J.B. Straubel and Ian Wright, were allowed to retroactively call themselves co-founders in the settling of a lawsuit with Eberhard and Tarpening. So not only did he buy the title of founder in a settlement, yeah, he is responsible for kicking out the actual founders. That's like the actual people wild. who, you know, designed and built, you know, the company, designed <laughs> like nothing, the product nothing, and built the company. Nothing matters. Like you, even if you come up with something cool, it might not matter. That might not actually matter. David Bivian's another answer on Quora said, uh, oh, who is a small business owner, period, pilot, period, entrepreneur. Hell yes. Wow. I think uh, I'm going to start putting pilot in all my bios and just like. And then when they're like taking me on on a on a on a flight, I'm like, well, I'm also like an eco warrior too. So I'm yeah. not gonna just you want me to just fly on a plane. You want me? Oh, you just all that damage is for that? No, thank you. Yeah, you think I'm but a hypocrite? But I am a pilot, like Leo DiCaprio or Radiohead. Yeah, yeah Radiohead. Yeah, you, do I look like a Radiohead? Okay, David Bivian's pilot says he was there at the first meeting and provided the funding. <laughs> He, so he was there, Tony. He was there at the very first meeting. He was in a chair. I remember that. But like, he, that was the first like. But the first meeting was probably like the first meeting with investors. You know? Yeah, what I mean? that's the most important thing. He's the only one that counts. Yeah. He also designed their first production car after the first CEO. And I know C, it's it has to be capitalized, but I still like screaming it. No, you got to. Well, I mean, it, it's 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 like a, out of respect, you have to yell CEO. It's tradition. After the first CEO was caught committing fraud, and the entire thing had to be redesigned. So Not yes, fraud. so yes, he is legally considered a founder. Well, that's none of that has anything to do with why he's legally considered a founder. There's no law saying if you design the first production car, you are the founder. By the way designed their first production car do not believe that for no, one second not even this a is little bit definitely a homer simpson situation where he <laughs> drew a bubble on top of a rectangle and was like this is what it needs to be and then a hundred other like, people work. yeah like actually did it actually did things you know i read so much cool stuff about tesla when i was trying to like figure out this this brain genius this you know master of the universe of elon musk and you know uh this is just from wikipedia we're n we're now going to be yes. one of those podcasts that just reads wikipedia to people which make like fifty thousand dollars a month uh so i'm expecting that to start happening well, well i mean uh, i would i would donate to wikipedia more if, if, if you know more mm -hmm. people were, were you know subscribed on December 30th, 2021, Tesla announced that they are recalling more than 475,000 U.S. model vehicles. That's so many. Uh, the recall was not linked to a contemporaneous issue regarding the passenger play feature, which allowed games to be played on the touchscreen while the car is in motion. After an investigation was launched by the NHTSA covering 50, 585,000 vehicles, Tesla agreed to make changes where the feature would be locked and unusable while the car is moving. I thought that was weird because I can't even like pair my phone to my stereo if I'm in motion. Mm. 
You know, most cars yeah. won't let you do that. But the Tesla was was kind of like fuck it. Like they were very much like, "No, nah, it's cool. Even if you like, even if you can't drive, we got you." And like that was so what? What a wild statement. Well, that was sick until they caved to pressure by the NA, NHTSA. They wouldn't let drivers also be gamers. Oh, I, oh, because I'm a gamer, That's I can't up. drive a car. I guess That's gamers, Tony. They came for gamers. That's uh. And and the thing is, that's like a pretty big portion of the market. That's pretty fucked up. Yeah. I mean, just buying a Tesla in itself, in and of itself, seems like a game. And you know, the odds the odds aren't always great, but sometimes <laughs> it works out. Sometimes it does, and then sometimes it just stops on you in the middle of the freeway in the middle you know? of the night. And there, it's like there's a bunch of mini games too on the Tesla. Like, <laughs> get your get your door open in freezing temperatures. <laughs> yeah, get your, let 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 somebody in your in your car while you're trying to make money in your gig job. When you rented this car because you're kind of stuck in a, between a rock and a hard place, and people can't get in your car, so you get bad reviews, and then you end up paying for that day of Uber driving. Yeah, it's it's like a, a game of saw, but in your own car. <laughs> Yeah, it's exciting. I like that. If you allow the AI to kill this pedestrian, you will survive. However, you can steer around it and drive straight into a turnbuckle. The choice is yours. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A turnbuckle, a cyclist, or a black person. 